but it is. But ever since that Montgomery fight, bro, like, I just feel some type of way, you feel me? It's like, bro, a lot of us been waiting on shit like that to happen, you feel me? I feel like that shit activated something in me, man. And it feel like if all of us get together right now, bro, we can dominate. For sure, for sure. I'm talking about that's what it feel like right now. That's what that's the feeling it's giving right now. A feeling that we've been supposed to have. See how that shit got y'all feeling though, bro? I swear to God, bro. I know that shit got the whole world feeling good, bro. The whole black community feeling good as hell, bro. On my soul, bro. The taste, that's just a little taste. Think about if we had it. Man, think about if we grabbed it all, bro. Think about if we grabbed You feel me? You hear me? That shit'll feel so good. That's how if we do get together. Maybe, bro, we can feel we can feel good for the rest of our lives, G. Shalom, shalom. It's the brother Adab Yard from the GMS Mobile, Alabama camp, coming at you with another lesson. But before I get started, I want to give all glory, praises, and honor unto Yahweh by a ship, Yahweh Shah, by a ship of Pastor Bash. Double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone to teach rule well, peace, sanitation, the whole thing. Let this guy abroad preaching the truth, sincerity. So you all want to say shout out one. All right, I'm, I'm on the plantation right now, you know, trying to get a little quick one in. All right, and, you know, believe it or not, hey, Jake's still feel activated, man. And, and more memes and videos are still being created. All right, this, <laughs> this could be something old, but I'm just seeing it. All right, and, and Jake don't know when to stop bragging, you know, when, when he get that feeling of victory in anything, you know. And, 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 and these things will be shared, you know, millions of times, man. You know, these memes and, and videos and stuff. But through the spirit, hey, it's getting the Esau and pissing them off, man. Now, now you have a, another event that occurred over in Atlanta where this guy that appears to be an Edomite, I don't know, you know, because I only seen it from, from one angle, but he drove straight through a crowd of Jake hitting the gas, running them over. The cops was by, was behind him, you know, chasing him, but the point is, if it were a crowd of Edomite, he probably would have would have blew his horn or something, but dude bent the corner and smashed the gas. <laughs> now, if it was an Edomite and not a, a so-called Mexican or Puerto Rican or something, then Edomite's well, probably would we'll, we'll start making memes of, of a black dog ram wearing a mullet and, and a tailgate full of Budweiser cans or something to, to, to clap back at Jake Means, man. You know, which could easily pop off, you know, the the race war. But that's part of Esau's agenda, which is to cause chaos in the street so he can move in with his plan. But this is Genesis 49 and 9. Judah is alliance whip. From the prey, my son, thou art gone up. He stooped down, he couched as a lion, and as an old lion, who shall rouse him up? The Lord Yahweh by Shimei was shot, you know, shall rouse him up, you know, and that goes to show you that man's goings is of the Lord because Esau created that Black Lives Matter movement, you know, with, with in fact, you know, marching through the city armed with guns and, and meeting up from city to city to get Jake roused up, but uh, Jake didn't rise, man. And, and, and the, the the members of, of this coalition, you know, coalition, you know, shoot shoot themselves, man. You know, shot himself, and, 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 and I, I believe he hit a, another member as well. You know, it was just a big mess, you know. But if if that was the Lord's purpose, right there and there. You know, it would have followed through smoothly, and we would probably be pilgrims on earth right now. But that's a cut to Esau's pride of him not being totally in control like he think he is. This is Ezekiel 25 and 13. Therefore, thus said the Lord, how I will also stretch out my hand upon Edom and will cut off man and beast from it, and I will make it desolate from teeming, and they of the Dan shall fall by the sword. All right, the Lord has a perpetual hatred against Esau, man. And the Lord will bring righteous judgment upon the Edomites by his chosen nation, Israel, man. Verse 14, and I will lay my vengeance upon Edom by the hand of my people, Israel. 
and they shall do an Edom according to my anger and according to my fear, and they shall know my vengeance, said the Lord Yahweh. Come. And you know, Jake for the most part is is completely soft when it comes to a sheet of mud. But the Lord put his spirit on Jake to beat her ass with that chair most of the time. <laughs> so something that like that the Lord had Jake do, how much more something heavy when our hell break loose. And his prophets, hey, they're gonna get some get back as well when they receive those new bodies because the scriptures say that he sent them out as fishes to fit men to fish men. And then, you know, we would then we turn them into hunters, you know, to, to hunt men after, after his elected seal, you know, roughly paraphrasing. But um, Isaiah 41 and 15, behold, I will make thee a new sharp instrument, a new sharp thrusting instrument, having teeth. Thou shalt thrust the mountains and beat them small and shall make the hills as chafe. All right. And a nation of people are likened to mountains and, and hills. And, you know, the Lord will cause his elect to pulverize these people, man. You know, to smite these people. <laughs> like the scriptures say, one shall chase a thousand and two ten thousand. And, and who, who would have the power to do so, man? The Lord's elect with their new bodies and spiritual powers, man. The two-thirds will have no spiritual power. They will fight with carnal weapons. You know, which would be their guns and, and knives and things like that. You know, and, and this dude looked like he he have uh, you know some switches and, and dracos, man. But in fact, they'll be put to death as well by the Lord elect because they didn't repent and return unto the Lord their power. But because the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, you know, his elect will receive spiritual power because his elect would need it to go up against Esau's technology in that day, man. Esau got some shit Jake ain't seen before. Jake, Jake think Esau only working with with with, with AR fifteens and, and AK forty seven nine millimeters, you know, forties and forty fives and you know stuff like that, man. Esau got something that's, that's on a whole nother level, man. But um, verse sixteen, Isaiah forty one and sixteen, thou shalt fan them. And the wind shall carry them away, and the whirlwind shall scatter them, and thou shalt rejoice in the Lord Yahweh, and shall glory in the Holy One of Israel. Fine, man. Hey, gone with the wind, man. And and the Lord is do his glory, praise and honor, man. So with that being said, call her Lord Yahweh by Shemiah Shah. This lesson was edified to you. I want to say shalom.